Is this collateral? Is this the alleyway from fucking collateral? So, this is a streamlight. It's one of those multi modes where you can double tap it and you can turn it on to uh, the strobe. But I don't do it. We programmed it, so now it's just positive on off. So you can do this through, but I like it just to have a push button. Right? Yeah. Like, you can double tap it, it's just a lot of buttonology. Yep. Like, we don't want it. But you put it on a piece of bungee, so we can keep it on the back of our hand, we can still work. Now we can turn around and we can have it. So you can load it, like a fist load, for a weight, but it's really for a slap. Right. It's like a big plumber slap, like that kind of shot. So we get in this big combative situation, and I've got to brace him up and smash him with this thing. I can just hit him with it. But the big thing is I can explain it. Yeah. Like, it's a fucking flashlight. Because in my pocket, why do you have it like this? Well, it's hands free. A mechanic, I work on my car, I have my flashlight, I put it on, now I can use my hands. Right. I can explain it. Without I can't explain. Yeah, like, I can carry it on a bag, I carry it on every airplane I fly on. Yeah. It gives me an option, right? It's an everyday tool, but yeah, it's just shrink wrap and bungee. You just size it to your hand. So it's made for you. You don't want it loose. If you get a little loose in this, you can flick it and it'll wing on the back of your hand. So it's one of those. This thing's a little bit too tight, but it's got a strong purchase to it. But a lot of the combatants we were doing for like a low vis shit, it started off with a bleach. So a quick light. But if I do it to coal real fast, you kind of lose sensory. So when there's no ambient light and you hit them with that, you can move off a center line and that's how you kind of initiate the whole process. It just became part of your EDC. Just carry it everywhere you want.